The storm could cause massive flooding, power outages, coastal storm surge, and tornadoes. And of course, this will be the first big hurricane of the season to hit Florida, and it is hitting an already stressed property market. Florida homeowners will be especially nervous about this one as several major insurers have pulled out of our state in recent months. Yeah, CBS 12's Amber Robb is joining us tonight live in West Palm Beach with the insurance officials and what they have to say about the impact it could have on the market. Amber. Even though homeowners over here won't feel the direct impact of Idalia, insurance officials say they could feel the financial impact in the future. And that's because a storm like this will cause a lot of damage that will trigger insurance claims in a market that's already in crisis. Florida's insurance crisis. As Tropical Storm Idalia intensifies into a hurricane heading for Florida's west coast, insurance officials are preparing for the impact. Mark Friedlander with the Insurance Information Institute says the number of claims filed is really dependent on how intense the storm is and where it lands. Typically from a major hurricane, we will see several hundred thousand claims filed, and that includes homes, condos, renter's insurance, business policies, agriculture policies, auto policies, all different types of of insurance policy. Friedlander says there are two big reasons homeowners and insurers are feeling more of a financial burden. One is more people living in harm's way than ever before. We're seeing coastal areas not only of Florida, but of other states continue to grow in terms of population. And the other big issue is replacement costs have gone up so much. Friedlander also says Florida's problem has to do with legal system abuse and claim fraud, which threatens coverage affordability and availability for residents. This past legislative session, lawmakers worked to pass laws that help prevent this abuse. Owner and CEO of Access Insurance Underwriter, Philip Wardell, says those new laws are going to make a big difference. The new legislation is going to have a tremendous impact. We're already seeing four new companies coming into the state. And with those new companies, better rates are soon to follow. My advice to consumers right now is probably hang tough for another year and suck it up and and then you're going to start seeing a lot more competition coming and that'll start in October. Wardell says hurricanes will always affect rates, but companies will have a better idea of just how costly the hurricane is after it hits. But according to Wardell, the financial impact that is passed on to consumers won't be felt until at least the next year. Reporting live in West Palm Beach, I'm Amber Robb, CBS 12 News.